It's your boy Nodo. Coming to you with more videos, coming to you with more content, man. And in today's video, we're going to talk about the truth about why some women just don't want to deal with handsome select men. Guys. If you're new here or you've already been here, go ahead and click that like button. Go ahead and comment. Go ahead and subscribe and click that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I drop a video. And without further ado, let's going to dive into this chocolate topic, guys. So the thing is with this, guys, like, you just got to understand that some women just aren't going to want to deal with a handsome select man, guys. They're just not going to want to deal with it. And um, some of the reasons are, I'll give you a few of them right now. One of the reasons is like, one, they might think that you just look too good. It is what it is. They might just automatically just think you look too good. I had women tell me in my inbox before and in person and all that, just saying that, dang, you're a boy and you look prettier than me. I don't, you know, you see what I mean? They might think that you look way better than them. And it's not like a competition or nothing like that, but I've actually had women come and tell me that. So it is what it is. It'll happen. And they'll probably, a lot of this can stem from their own insecurities. Because, you know, even the baddest and prettiest women can be insecure, as we know for sure by now. So the thing is, a lot of women just ain't going to, if you, you think about it, even though women want to be the prettier one in the relationship, they want to be the better looking one in the relationship. So it'll make it harder for an answer to let man in that aspect as well. Because it just, it just puts them out. They don't want to be in competition, looks wise, with their mate. They already do enough as it is to go in the mirror and make themselves look good as they possibly can every day. And whatever enhancements they use, whether it's makeup, hair, whatever they do, as it is, they already do a lot of looks maxing every damn day, probably spending hours in the mirror. They don't want to compete with you for the mirror. Even if you ain't got to be the pretty, pretty, pretty boy type, handsome, select dude, but either way, when y'all out in public, she want to be the one that's shining. But they don't mean they don't want somebody that look good, but they don't want somebody to look way better than them, like miles ahead. You know, a woman know if a man looks miles ahead of them. It is, it is what it is. We can just sit there and we can assess that she can look at them but like damn do i look good beside them it ain't always about does the man look good beside the woman the woman want to know does do i look good next to him and that's gonna be a problem if they gotta sit there and they can't they can't really just they can't gauge that and they gotta really ask themselves that question they're gonna be like i don't know i don't think i want to deal with that and another thing is it's a lot that comes with being with a handsome select dude there's a lot that come with that because you got to worry about the women, you got to worry about this the ego of the man, depending on who it is. They, they of course they're gonna be like, damn, if if is he gonna be that type of oh damn, he feel like he all that? Do I have to deal with this ego? Because most of them already think that we just have this big, huge ego that we just can't just get over. So they don't want to deal with that. So they already automatically gonna think that you're stuck up on your sedity and that you're a narcissist because of how you look. You are you automatically judge by your appearance. So a lot of them ain't gonna want to deal with you because they think that, oh, you you feel like you're uppity. You feel like you on top of the world. You feel like you're better than everybody. It's one thing, a lot of, a woman likes a determined man, but this is a different thing when it's with attraction. It's a real way, way different thing with dealing with a handsome select man, for sure. And they know it's a lot that come with us too, especially when it comes to the women. And they don't want to deal with all that extra competition, worrying about whether you can you talk them because your ability to get other women is what would terrify her. It would want to steer her away, but like, damn, why well, I gotta do that? I feel like I'm in big competition. Like, damn, he can get all these chicks. Damn, dude. And then at the same time, you know they always comparing themselves to other chicks. So if they see other chicks that you could possibly get and it's eyeing you down. Everywhere y'all go, bro, she gonna think about like, damn, am I gonna deal with this all the time? And then they gonna think about, damn, I, I see that he looks good to me. I know he looks good to a lot of other women. So it ain't gonna just be like, oh, damn. I, maybe I can, I can measure up, but you know, they, they gonna think about it. A lot of women gonna be wanting you anyway, so they, gonna, they don't wanna be in too much competition with you. They don't want to deal with the extra girls and all that, and because you know when you in, when they when you in public, you notice something. There's a lot of women that like to make eyes at other other girls' men, so that happens too. They'll be like, "Damn, do I have to worry about all this snickering? These 
just sneak this in there as a, a stairs every time she come out with her man. Is she gonna wanna have to deal with that? Cause yeah, even especially it ain't it ain't just one way with how dudes be hating on select men, uh, and just because they see a girl and they feel like, oh damn, what the hell he doing with her? Yeah, they gonna be like, what the hell is she doing with him when it come to y'all? When it come to us? In your situation and in my situation. So they most likely ain't gonna wanna deal with that. A lot of them just don't wanna deal with that shit. It's it's a lot of pressure. And then another thing is a woman some women just want like a regular relationship. Probably like a regular dude or like, you know, just to deal with. Like a regular smuggler dude. Like it's, it could be like just like a re, like a dude say, I don't wanna deal with no bad bad women no bad bitches or nothing like that i just want a normal female that is co- i can come on to she cook me a nice cook home cooked meal or something like that it could be something like that they just want a normal dude they don't want nothing extravagant because of all the extra stuff that come with it. i just want me a normal dude no i see that some girls be like i just want me an ugly dude that nobody want or something which is not true but they just want somebody to their self at this point in time because now they probably been in, in situations where they had to compete what they do while they was with their dude. They don't they don't really want to have to do all that comp- competition. You know what I'm saying? Like they'll they'll make things they'll make things different when it's time for you to get with them. But it seems like as soon as you get within in the confines of a relationship or whatever type of situation you get into with them, they want things to change in their favor. But not remembering that everything comes with you. We go through a lot of struggles as handsome select men as it is. So that being compounded with her, her being with you, she yeah, she's going to know that. She's going to know that. So that's why a lot of women ain't going to want to deal with this handsome select, man. It is, they'll just automatically just watch you out with like, oh, I ain't going to deal with that. Oh, that's a headache. Why you think that every time they be like, damn, ooh, he fine, but that's a headache. They always be saying shit like that. They always say that shit like, damn, he a headache. Oh, he going to make me, uh, he, you know what I'm saying? He going to make me do something or whatever. They always think of the worst. You always wonder, do you ever wonder why they always think like that? Because they know what come with us. They know we have a lot of challenges. They know that we're going to deal with hate. We're going to deal with hate from other dudes, from, from women. The women going to be challenging them because they with you. Yeah, especially women that probably don't think that they de- that, that woman deserves that type of man. And they look like, damn, what am I doing wrong? Maybe let me take a chance. Hey, if she can get him, I know I can too. So she got to deal with that too. And a lot of women just don't want to deal with that shit. It's just keeping it a book. And if a woman don't want to deal with you guys like that, don't look at it as rejection. It's just don't look at it as rejection. Don't be looking. Don't look at it as a oh man, you don't want me. I don't look good, and you just oh yeah. Some just respectfully just don't want to deal with it. That don't mean you don't look good. That don't mean that he's not possibly attracted to you. She just don't want to deal with everything that comes with you. It just it's, it just it's just it is what it is. It's almost like a dude with a whole bunch of baby mamas that she got to keep dealing with with all these kids, and it's almost like that. It's almost like having baby mama drama without having babies. It's almost like that. Actually, it's, it's, it's exactly like that. Almost, it's exactly like that. But anyway, it's your boy Noto coming to another video, coming to you more content, man. And if you enjoying the content, man, go ahead and click that like button. Go ahead and comment. Go ahead and subscribe. And click that notification bell so you can be notified whenever I drop a video. And without further ado, hey, remember, anybody can improve themselves if they're willing to work at it. I'm out.